All right, well, we are looking at a cooler afternoon on the way, and we are looking at mostly sunny skies across much of the state. One exception is the northern mountains where we're still hanging on to a little bit of cloud cover and we're trying to hold on to a little bit of the snowfall on the ground there as well. In fact, some ski resorts such as Angel Fire are already reporting that they're making snow and this is the earliest that they've been able to make snow in about 10 years. So things are at least looking up for the snow making and we're not looking at much in the way of winter storms this week, but next week may be a different story. More details on that to come, but for today we're looking at mostly sunny skies in the metro area and 56 degrees the current temperature. So it is quite a bit cooler than where we were yesterday. North northwest wind at nine miles per hour now. Temperatures across the north still sitting in the 40s for a few locations from Rotone down to Las Vegas, Taos and Alamosa all still stuck in the upper 40s right now. Down to the south we are warming up things a bit. We're in the low 60s across several locations, but Roswell still sitting in the upper 50s in the eastern part of the state is really the part of the state that's going to see the biggest cool down for today from where we were yesterday afternoon. And we are continuing to see at least a few gusty pockets of wind across the eastern portion of the state. 22 mile per hour wind gusts in Clovis, 20 for Hobbs, 20 also for Alamogordo and 17 in Las Cruces. But all in all, the winds are continuing to come down and we'll be dealing with less wind throughout the afternoon as our front continues to make progress across the state. As far as the cloud cover goes, there's not much of it. The visible satellite just trying to pick up a little bit of that cloud cover over the northern mountains, but even these areas are going to be mostly sunny by the time we reach sunset tonight. And the next couple of days, not looking too bad. We have the cold front sliding through today, but those temperatures are going to rebound very nicely through the next couple of days as we continue with that temperature drop for this afternoon and those winds continue to come down as well. But as we move into your Tuesday and Wednesday, we start to build into a little bit of a ridge and that will allow for a westerly flow which will help warm temperatures up as we move through the middle part of the work week. Now we will be watching for a weak disturbance to pass overhead toward the end of the week. That could lead to a few spot showers, but there's not much moisture associated with this disturbance. So most of us will be staying dry right on through the end of the work week. It won't be until next week that we're watching for another storm to move into our direction, and that may bring us a much better shot at a few showers and some much needed snow across the northern mountains and even into the Sandias and possibly the Sacramento's as well. Again, more details on that throughout the week. Southern Colorado temperatures into the 50s for this afternoon, lots of sunshine, and we'll continue to warm things up into the middle part of the work week, perhaps grabbing a couple of showers with that disturbance on Friday before clearing out for the weekend. Over the northwest, mostly sunny skies, highs in the upper 50s to low 60s. We continue to warm up here as well, mid 60s Wednesday, upper 60s for Thursday. Then maybe a chance at a couple of spot showers for Friday. Over the southwest, lots of sunshine, temperatures in the upper 60s to low 70s. The front finally makes it across the southwestern corner of the state for tomorrow, so we will be a little bit cooler for Tuesday before rebounding temperatures on Wednesday, perhaps a couple of showers over the Gila for Friday. Over the southeast, sunny and cooler for the afternoon. We'll stay in the mid to upper 60s this afternoon, but back into the 70s for the rest of the work week. Maybe a couple of spot showers on Friday and then clearing out for the weekend. Over the northeast, we did have that chance at a couple of showers earlier this morning, but things are clearing out very nicely, mostly sunny through the rest of the afternoon and into the middle part of the work week. Another shot at a shower or two on Friday. Over the northern mountains, we're clearing out here as well, partly to mostly sunny through the afternoon with a chance at showers once again on Friday before clearing out for the weekend. Over the east mountains, mostly Mostly sunny temperatures in the mid 50s and the low 60s for the metro area. We were looking at those windy conditions this morning. Those are now starting to go away. And as we move into the middle part of the work week, we will start to warm things up. Perhaps a few clouds with that disturbance for the end of the week. Okay, thank you, John.